let's look what happens when we multiply two measurement numbers and you know they each have their own units so if we take four feet times three feet well four times three is twelve but we would also get feet times feet and usually you know it's kind of cumbersome to write feet times feet so usually we'd write feet squared um, a, another common way that this is written is square feet um, and actually the, oftentimes that's pronounced instead of saying feet squared we, we pronounce that square feet and now be careful that this square that's showing up here does not affect that 12 this is just saying we have two copies of this feet this is a um, this is directly because when we're multiplying these things together the units act in the exact same way as any factors so feet times feet is feet squared um, we just have this specialized way that we tend to describe it as you know, square feet we can do the same thing with inches uh, if we have two inches times three inches times five inches well two times three is six multiply that by five we get thirty and we have inches times inches times inches well that would be inches cubed but um, you know again since we see these so so frequently we have another way we commonly describe this we, we describe it as cubic inches um, cubic inches I don't normally see it that way usually usually I see it described this way uh, 30 inches cubed 30 cubic inches would look like this 